Yo, uh, this is Joseph, and today I'm gonna show you a quick video review on how to install PUBG Mobile to your PC via emulator. Well, it says here that Tencent's best ever emulator for PUBG Mobile. I know that you've been waiting for this for them to release an almost perfect emulator like this. This is the answer. And yes, this is the answer. And for those gamers who want to play PUBG Mobile in desktop, let's check this out. Okay guys, first you need to download the emulator via syzs.qq.com forward slash en. I have posted the link below, so check that one out. After downloading, click install. And of course, you need to go through the installation process, and I'm assuming that you already know that. While waiting for the game to install, you can go to the menu, settings, then engine section. Now, if you have a gaming desktop or laptop, maximize all the settings indicated in that section. Direct X, prioritize, dedicated GPU, anti-aliasing, ultimate, now memory, 2 GB and the processor will be 4 cores. Now, the resolution here is unfortunately can only support 1920 by 1080p. And for those who has 2560 by 1080p or more, then you can't enjoy the wide angle of capability of your monitor as of the moment. Same as I do. Maybe future updates will cover all resolutions that are available in the market. DPI 480. Same in mobile, uh, three resolutions that you can choose and those support Ultra HD, so Ultra HD 2K will do. Um, once click save, uh, game will restart. And while waiting, on the right side you can see the controller keys and you might also want to double check the settings once again. And yes, the display quality should be HD instead of auto. Make sure to check again if the engine section changed after the game restarted. Now if you have an existing account, then no need to worry because it will not suggest you to create an account again, just like other emulators out there. And this is an emulator, then you are only subject to be paired with those who are using emulator. And if you have a group, then you should suggest them to use this. Then low, medium, high is still available. And look at that. The graphics, the resolution are so smooth. I'm so excited to play this one. Now you might want to check the settings under basic gra graphics change to uh, realistic and controls and uh, other uh, settings that you might want to change. And of course, the uh, language. And all are the same settings when you were playing from the mobile. Now let's play solo and test design keyboard keys. Here graphics look stunning. The keys are, are working perfectly. So excited to find a gun and test it. <laughs> now jump and sprint are s smooth and Opening a door, which is the same F key, and uh, look at that. How fast you can pick those things. Notice the letter F, G, and H keys. It will let you choose the first three items based on your needs, now, flawless and fast. Now, unlike the other emulators, notice there are no map buttons that uh, you can see on the screen. It is definitely helpful for you to see what's happening on your surroundings without those screen buttons. The screen is so clean. The version of this emulator is still on beta and it worked really well already. So far, there are no lag and bug issues that I encountered. And the only thing that I'm concerned uh, of with this is the uh, driving navigation. Because once you move your mouse left to right, right to left, it is uh, so sensitive. 
uh, even if you already adjusted the mouse based on your sensitivity preferences. Now I can say that it's uh, better to, 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 drive, to drive a, a vehicle in this uh, emulator than any uh, mobile or emulators out there. Other than that, all are working flawless. <laughs> Absolutely, definitely, unquestionably, surely a big difference in there. And the course here is accurate. You can easily see the enemy even if it's far. And I think that is being uh, and because of the uh, HD capabilities of the emulator. And uh, minimizing the screen will let you enjoy the full potential uh, of uh, Ultra HD as well. And that's all for now. See you next time. And if you like this video, please don't forget to subscribe and click the subscribe button below. Once again, this is Yosef. Thanks.